Hello, folks. Welcome to CES 2023. Thanks for joining us today to talk a little bit about microvision and our strategy going into 2023. Now, we believe 2023 is going to be a pivotal year for companies in the LiDAR technology landscape. And that's because we expect OEMs to make decisions around what technology partners they're going to use to bring advanced driver safety features to their fleets and to their vehicles. Uh, these decisions are going to represent uh, possibly 100 million LiDAR units and $80 billion in spend. But the impact of these decisions goes beyond the finances alone. It's also going to usher in the next generation of driver safety so drivers can respond sooner. It's going to be at the scale and significance of innovations like seat belts and airbags and anti-lock brakes. The question becomes, what are the criteria that OEMs are looking for in selecting these technology partners to make these decisions? Well, we've spoken to a number of these OEMs, and we boil it down to four key things. The first is low-profile LiDAR hardware with low power requirements. The reason this is important is because it's going to enable OEMs to deploy these LiDAR sensors in new and innovative ways, not just behind the grill or behind the windshield, but perhaps even uh, integrated into the roof line of the vehicle without an obtrusive bump. While there are a lot of LiDAR sensors out there, many of them are far too bulky to permit these kinds of innovative deployments. The second thing is high resolution. Now, resolution is important because it means that you're able to see potential obstacles or threats on the road. But just as important as resolution alone is resolution at range, the ability to see objects far in the distance, up to 220 meters. Now, the reason this is important is because when you're building features for highway speeds, you need to be able to see farther in order to respond faster. The third criteria is scalability. OEMs have reiterated to us the importance of hardware with a strong supply chain and known costs. And fourth is object level perception software. Now, in order to get LiDAR to market quickly, it's important for them to find efficient and cost-effective ways uh, to bring these innovations to market. And this is going to require OEMs to consider new approaches, things like object-level perception uh, running in a custom ASIC. Now, Microvision ticks all of these boxes and more. Over the next few minutes, we are going to share with you why Microvision's in a very unique position in the market as the leading hardware and software company to bring these advanced safety features to market in uh, a really uh, fast and cost-effective way. You'll learn why uh, OEMs are sharing comments like these, that Microvision is the best LiDAR product that they've seen, and why they're giving Microvision compliments on uh, the point cloud quality, the low profile design, things like deployment flexibility, and the solution maturity that they're seeing relative to other LiDAR hardware that's out there. Our ability to compete and win really boils down to three key things. The first is superior technology. Uh, Microvision is the only LiDAR company that has the hardware and software to deliver these advanced driver safety features at highway speeds. Let's talk a little bit more about what that means. We see our superior technology breaking down into two key elements, our LiDAR hardware and perception software. Our leading uh, LiDAR hardware, Microvision Maven, is a dynamic range sensor, which means that it combines three fields of view into one hardware unit. You'll see here on the screen that we are uh, demonstrating uh, both short, medium, and long-range sensing in one point cloud. We've got uh, short, medium, and there we've got long. Uh, we deliver this in different fields of view and stitch these images together to create one ultra-high resolution point cloud. This is really important because it permits additional uh, advanced safety use cases. The other thing you'll notice is the incredible low latency of the Microvision Maven uh, hardware. You'll see that you can pick up really detailed things on the road or the side of the road, things like cyclists or motorcyclists uh, that are coming in uh, oncoming traffic or even pedestrians at the side of the road like you see there on the left-hand side. You'll also notice that we can pick up road markings and even see the condition of the surface of the road itself. The uh, 
quality of our point cloud is simply unprecedented. The resolution, the range, the low latency. And while a lot of other uh, LiDAR companies are producing videos, they're using other data inputs, things like cameras or radar to fill in gaps in their point cloud. Whereas what you see here, these videos and the point cloud that we've got in the booth is 100% pure, 100% LiDAR. Another thing that's really important is our ability to track multiple objects on the road. This is difficult for a number of reasons, and other LiDAR companies will find that they lose or confuse these types of objects. But this kind of use case is critical for highway driving. We've got more uh, great point cloud uh, footage showing the range and the resolution of the Microvision point cloud, as well as the detail that you'll see. We also offer object level perception, which means we can identify and track different objects. You'll see here in this clip, uh, we are able to you know, distinguish the car from the barrier. And all of these are really important for delivering this next generation of advanced safety features. Another really important uh, aspect of our solution is that we operate uh, a, or we've designed and developed a, uh, a custom ASIC. Now, the reason this is important is because it optimizes our solution for cost, for speed, but also for seamless integration into any OEM architecture. Uh, and all of this is backed by incredible intellectual property, uh, supported by 430 patents, and industry know-how and experience developed over 20 years of productizing MEMS-based technology. So that is our superior technology. The second key thing that allows us to compete and win is our strategy of focusing on OEMs. We are taking the approach of focusing on and partnering with OEMs. And this is going to allow them to bring this innovative new technology to market faster in a more cost effective way. There are a number of different ways that we deliver this. First, we've designed our entire solution to make it easy for OEMs to develop and deploy. Uh, second, as we've already talked about, Maven's low profile sensor allows for more flexible deployment options. It also means that it takes up less space on the vehicle and contributes less weight. Another factor to consider is that you require fewer sensors on the vehicle with less power consumption. This allows us to deliver LiDAR enabled ADAS at a lower total cost to the OEM. And finally, our solution uses materials known to OEM supply chains today. This is important because it doesn't contribute any supply chain challenges, and it allows OEMs to bring this technology to market uh, faster at scale and uh, at a little lower overall cost structure. So that is um, the second key factor that we wanted to touch on, which is our strategy of focusing on OEMs. The final thing is our proven track record. Now, this is important to highlight. There are a lot of LiDAR companies uh, on the market today. Many of them are startups. But Microvision has 20 years of experience developing and delivering technology for some of the best, uh, biggest and best technology companies out there, like Sony, Microsoft, and Sharp. We also deliver core technologies to US Department of Defense. So Microvision has experience bringing products to market. On this theme of uh, delivering on our commitments and uh, building a, a strong track record for execution, 2022 was a pivotal year. We accomplished a number of key milestones delivered on our commitments from uh, introducing new test vehicles, running track testing to capture ground truth data and validate our solution, uh, to automating our sample, uh, our sample line, uh, city driving tests in Germany, uh, achieving class one compliance, all of which set us up to begin delivering samples to customers earlier, uh, or actually at the end of 2022. Another really important thing to highlight, uh, which we announced in December, is the intention to acquire IBEO, uh, a, a LiDAR company based out of Germany. And IBEO provides a lot of technology and expertise that'll help us to accelerate our go-to-market strategy and also generate multiple sources of revenue and use LiDAR in different use cases as well. So the IBEO acquisition is a really important step towards our goals. That brings us to exactly where we need to be coming into 2023. Um, so to summarize, we've got the unmatched hardware and software to deliver advanced driver safety at highway speeds. We've got the OEM focused strategy that allows OEMs to take our solution and tailor it to their specific program requirements in a way that allows them to get to market faster and um, 
uh, scale it and achieve a, a lower uh, overall system cost. We've got the proven track record. So while everyone else is talking about LiDAR, Microvision is ready and we're ready now. Thanks for joining us for a few minutes. I hope that gives you a great summary of, of uh, Microvision and our, our strategy for 2023. We've got a short video uh, here to highlight um, some of our progress in 2022. So thanks for spending some time with us and enjoy the rest of the show.